Blind in a broken arm, you're f***ing dead. <laughs> What's up, team? We're doing a new boot camp video. The Army Basic Training for Cadets at West Point. It's been a minute since we've done some new boot camp videos. We've done a lot of them. I mean, we started the channel doing boot camp videos. Now we're back to Army. I'm super excited. Let me know if you think West Point boot camp. More difficult than when you enter the military and go to, like, the typical enlisted boot camp. I think ours is way harder, even though now it's like super f easy. But who knows? Let's go ahead and send it. Land D on repel! Land D on the D! Right off the bat! There's literally cushioning and they got nice equipment. They're going slow and they're not getting yelled at. So it's definitely not f intense. <laughs> Dog ass! <laughs> What is this, bro? Is the cadre trying to be a cool guy? Because we got Patagonias. Wait, no, those are cries. Dope. Must repel down a 25 foot cliff face. Oh no, 25 feet. Jump. Hell yeah. You jumped two inches, bro. Look at all this happiness. He's like this, bro. <laughs> <laughs> you guys did it. Excited. I'm gonna attack it with enthusiasm. <laughs> like wild bears. Top students and soldiers apply each year. Only 10% get in. Who here has been denied by West Point? Since it says only 10% make it, which I'm, I'm curious to see if anybody in the chat has applied but not made it. The 47 month journey that creates the next generation of go, leaders. Go. Bro, she looks intense. These dudes look like little. She leading the fight, bro. We be in a firefight. I just see this coming down the road, bro. Uh, uh, uh. We're gonna make it. Let's go. The most important thing we do at West Point is teach Damn, leadership. Damn, sir. Build Someone go lick the sweat off the commander's face here, right now. Now. Hey, make sure you put it on safe and take your finger off the trigger next time, all right? Take your hand off the trigger, okay? Don't do that next time. Us in basic? Who'd have been like this? Oh, my God. Ugh. Don't ever do that shit. Again, stupid f That's what would have happened. Every soldier in basic training is qualified with a rifle. Most Get of it, them have never picked up a weapon in their life. These ranks for cadets piss me off. They shoot from five different positions. Let me know if when you called, you use this pad right here. Because if you did, f you, bro. That's the easy out, bro. You need to learn to shoot without that. Each dummy contains a sensor that, when hit, sends a signal up to the control tower adding a point to the cadet score. When we first like went to the ranges and shit like that, I thought shooting was cool. A week later, shooting wasn't fun or cool anymore. Why? Because you're at the range all day long, standing in the hot sun, waiting, shooting, going back to waiting, repeated process. It sucks, dude. Still managed to qualify with a 27, 28 my highest. You should not be able to be a officer if you don't qualify expert, bro. Oh, land nav. Cadets are taking their land navigation test. Dude, 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 where am I going? I don't know where the compass going. I need help in assistance. Oh, no. What's wrong, sir? Help me, I'm lost in the woods. Why the f can officers not do land nav? In the beginning, it was a joke. Come to find out, these motherfuckers don't know sh Each cadet receives unique coordinates and sets out to complete the test alone. When cadets find it, they must mark their scorecard using the attached hole God, puncher. It really sucks when you go up to your points and those things aren't there. If cadets are unable to find enough points in the allotted time, they fail the test. So the way that little puncher works is you have your, your map, right? And everybody has different points. And you're talking like a couple miles wide. Usually it's like three hours to get five points out of like seven. So you have to like run all the way around, use your land navigation skills. And when you get to the correct point on your scorecard, you have to stamp it. So that way it shows that you were there. All those stamps are different. So you can't cheat unless you've been to the point. Ambitious new cadets aim to beat record set. Don't do this. West. After only an hour and 31 minutes, a cadet has returned with all five points found correctly. Not bad. Not bad. F that. I would have been like, hey, where's your PC? You'd be like, what? I'm like, where's your patrol cap, head? I'm like, I lost it, but I got really fast on the points. I've been like, F you don't mean do push-ups. Yeah, don't aim to beat records when you got a basic and shit. Just go there, and do the minimum shit, because I promise you, none of that shit means New cadets are now ready to learn advanced skills. I am an American soldier! Is that a big booger on your face, dude? Ew! Ew. Teach them how to properly wear mop gear. 
So you, you don it, you put the mask uh, over the back of your head, you breathe the bad air out, you suck good air in, uh, it suctions to your face. Did you just say it sucks your face? What else does it suck, dude? Mop gear sucks, by the way. It's thick, uncomfortable, it's hot as and it's itchy as shit. What gas do they use? They fart really hard in a tube and it just <laughs> Should I go get all my mop gear? Okay, <laughs> gotta put this bullshit on. Gotta get it over my dump truck ass. Okay, let's go ahead and watch the rest of this one. Suck it again. Oh. Suck it hard. The first platoon enters the chamber. Go, 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 go. You check the mask, like you lift the mask up for about 10 seconds, and then you put it back down and seal it. <laughs> and after that, of course, you That's take my mask it off and do the soldier screed. The soldier's creed. I'm an American soldier. I'm a warrior member of the team. It's spicy. You feel the spice on your- Oh! That's the sound he's making, bro. He's not in pain. He's having such a good time. Three or four words in and you just start uh, choking and coughing. I like the choking CS and coughing. Gas. Are they making crack up in there, bro? I'll be in there, stirring up that crack. I'll be like, cookie, cookie, yeah, uh, uh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> uh, at least he's not being a <laughs> about it. Yeah. After a few seconds, it kind of goes away, yeah. and uh, it becomes a lot better, and you kind of can laugh about it. Nah, that's bullshit, bro. When you finally leave the gas chamber, it is such a sh situation because the fact that it's all leaving your body, it burns so bad. It's worse than when you were actually in there. All right, now I guess we're done with this bullshit. Oh, that's cool. Only a big old fat ass line on my forehead. I love doing this, shit, bro. This shit, bro. Bo, on you going face paint. I knew y'all were gonna say that because I saw them doing this and I was like, I ain't doing it. During the medical lane training event, it's cadets gonna be walk through a forest and are then ambushed by oh, enemy no, forces ambush? played by non-commissioned officers. Nobody yell contact, please, for the love of God. Where's the casualty? Where's the casualty? Oh, there, there, there. Oh, oh, oh. for two and a half. Oh, oh. Like, this down me. Oh, fuck. One cadet was hit by enemy fire. Boom. You are now blind and got a broken arm. Start screaming. Blind and a broken arm? You're f***ing dead. Ah, ah, okay, okay. <laughs> bro, put this kid in a f***ing movie, bro. They're like, you're dead. Cry for help. He's like, do I have like a wife or kids? Or or am I like a man just looking for a purpose? And I'm, I'm just injured and wounded, but I know I have to keep fighting and I have to call for my brother's sister. He's like, you're f***ing wounded. He's like, okay, got it. Ah! Those dummies are so heavy, dude. I'm Once not casualties lie. are relocated to a safe location, cadets radio in for helicopter rescue. Dust off, this is Pitbull. I have a medevac request. Oh, why are they not using ASIPs or like other radios? They're using stupid ass walkie talkies. You would never use this in real life. Oh, uh, definitely nerve wracking. Um, uh, it's pretty exciting, honestly. It is fun, dude. It's yeah, such it's a like fun time when you do exercises like this. Fun. The part after that where you get up because they're only going to talk about all the shit you guys did wrong is not fun but in the moment it's kind of fun they are brought to the mountaineering and repelling course what are you doing Lane three on repel where they learn Lane to safely the make their way down natural cliff faces in the new york mountains i did not realize how like rocky new york was until i went there one time new york like this bro new cadet williams started on Get the it, 25 bro. foot wall oh have a good time after conquering the 25 foot wall Williams was ready for the 75 foot wall. Get it, bro. See what's coming up? Jump, bro. Why are you walking, you dude? Jump. Go! Hell yeah! That's the ledge. They move to the mountaineering course and use their hands and feet to climb up the cliff face. Once cadets reach the top of the mountaineering lane, they're instructed to let go and walk backwards down. Fall to your course. death! They're like, what? Just fall, you're fine. As the end of summer nears, New cadets are ready to put their skills to the test. Bro, they're going to event war? called the Crucible. Let's go. What? They said the f Crucible? So we're now the Marine Corps. Look at these cool f tents. Hey, do you guys want to see what my tents look like in basic the training? Here. Super sick. Everything I'm about to show you is exactly what I had in basic training when we were sleeping outside to replace the tents, okay? This is it! F a sleeping bag! F a tent! I'm ready! Oh, but they're out there for like a long period of time. Yeah, been out there for like two weeks, bro. Platoons have two hours to map out eight different this stations given as coordinates. Bro. 
correctly locate them, and then complete the tasks to get as many points as possible, where they must move a partner on their back 50 yards. Carry your brother, you brother, 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 nice butt, dude. Could you imagine if this dude was running and he had no idea business since I was there? He's running with his buddy. He's like, I got you, bro. Don't worry. I'm going to take care of you. And all of a sudden, you see the camera, and he's just like, oh. <laughs> Dude, hardcore butt sniff. I think we did really good overall. Dude, yeah, you did At the very so last good, minute, which sir. Means we were Future, sir. Sorry. Six weeks after a riot. That is the sound of an officer's head at this point in their life, bro. Six weeks after arriving, West Point civilians were God able damn. to ring the bell. Ring the bell for what? Ring West Point tradition, nuts, bro. That signifies that cadet basic training is over. Well, you know what? You are some lucky motherfuckers that y'all are not going in anywhere, dude. Rip. Cadets complete a 12-mile ruck back to West Point's campus. After they already rang the bell or after? Alpha Company won the best company competition and led the class back to campus. I love how they're literally getting an entire f***ing, like, 12-mile f***ing parade. And, like, they've only completed the most basic of things, bro. Y'all gotta pull it together, dude. Cadets are welcomed by the community and parents to celebrate this milestone. I'm proud of myself. We were continually given challenges and we overcame them. I'm simply the best and, also and I'm always gonna be the best. Cause it's not about how hard you could throw a punch or how hard you could take one. It's about how often you get back up. True facts.